My name is Truma Sokotela, and I'm a performance artist. I'm Irshan Adams, and I'm a visual artist. I'm Tandi Nduli, and I'm a jazz musician. My name is Gemma Khan. I'm a theatre and filmmaker based in Johannesburg. My name is Musa Shadwayo. I am a dancer, choreographer, and a performing artist. My name is Guy Buttery, and I'm a fingerstyle guitar player from Durban. Our next guest has been labelled as something of a national treasure and one of South Africa's most influential artists over the past decade. Perhaps this is one of the reasons he was named the 2018 Standard Bank Young Artist winner for music. His name is Guy Buttery, a talented composer and guitarist from KwaZulu Natal. And while he joins us now from our Durban studio to tell us more about his plans for the National Arts Festival and what this award means to him. A very good morning to you, Guy, and a big congratulations on your award. Uh, thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate that. Nice to be here. Now, Guy, looking back at your musical journey uh, and having received this award, who would you say um, deserve? Who would you say is, uh, deserve to have their name alongside yours on the award? Just in terms of the support they've shown you over the years. Wow. Um, I think uh, there's been many people. You know, I. Um, I guess, uh, I guess, you know, the, the Arts Festival has really supported me. I think I did my very first um, performance at the National Arts Festival in 2003, and I was like 19 or something, and next year will be my 13th festival. Um, so the Arts Festival's really been supportive, but as have family and friends, and, uh, you know, last night I performed in Cape Town, and there's just people that have been coming for years, you know, and I appreciate that a whole lot, people that have constantly kind of supported the... the the music that I, that I make. So there's a bunch of uh, wonderful humans out there, you know? Oh, fantastic. Guy, you find yourself in the same league as uh, people such as Johnny Clegg and Smongi Le Kumalo. Uh, what does that personally mean to you? Wow, it, mean, it means a hell of a lot, really. And it's kind of overwhelming, I must admit, particularly those two that you mentioned, actually. Um, but yeah, I think what was so amazing for me was that this was the first time this award had been given to, for the music category, for a non-classical musician. Um, I think it's primarily been focused on classical and opera in the past. And uh, so, so the idea of the award was just not a possibility for me, I guess, because I, I make neither of those kinds of music. And um, it was quite a shock, I must admit. I was in uh, Grahamstown at the Arts Festival when I was told, and it was kind of overwhelming. And, and it means a whole bunch of things. I guess that, 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 that it's kind of an affirmation of, of what it is that I do. And uh, these kind of little guitar noodles that are, that are pieced together <laughs> obviously have some kind of value, I hope. So, uh, no, it's, 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 it's a huge honor, and, and I'm kind of deeply humbled by the whole thing, to be honest. I'm pretty sure it's one of the highlights in your journey. But what other highlights has there been throughout your, your music journey? And do you, do you think that having had those highlights sort of uh, confirms that you're definitely in the right space, that it, it, it validates that you are indeed doing what you're supposed to be doing? Sure, yeah, absolutely. I think so. I think these things are validations. I think they remind us that, that you know, that, that, that there is some value in what, what it is that we do. Um, there's been numerous highlights. I think uh, off the top of my head, I feel some of the collaborations I've done, I've been, I feel very kind of uh, privileged to have worked with some amazing humans who, as a teenager, I sort of grew up, you know, in awe of. Um, Vusi Maklesela, I got him to sing on my last record, and that was a really kind of magical moment for me. I'm a huge fan of his, and uh, I've worked with, with amazing people outside of South Africa as well, and been able to tour and make music. I've just come back from a tour in Brazil that went on to Zimbabwe, which went on to New Zealand, which has now gone on to Cape Town. So, so um, it's, it's been amazing to see all these um, amazing parts of the world and, and make music doing it. So many, many, many highlights. Yeah. Now, you've been named as something of a national treasure and as one of the most influential musicians over the past decade. Uh, what are you doing right? What, what's the secret to the success? 
Well, I don't know. I'm not even sure if I'm the right person to answer that question, to be honest. Um, oh, please, stop with the modesty. <laughs> <laughs> no, for real. I think that, I think that um, there's, 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 something, there's something there that I, that I think is a musical voice which has some kind of uh, identity, I guess, which, which, which resonates with people. I presume this is the correct answer to your question. I mean, I guess that there is... Um, there is a, a, a kind of amalgamation of different genres in the music that I make and uh, kind of largely kind of drawing from sounds from the southern part of this continent, uh, largely speaking. Um, and I guess that there's something kind of homely about that and, and, and people connect with that. Um, yeah, I'm not entirely sure, to be honest. <laughs> Well, Guy, congratulations <laughs> once again for your award and all your success, and we wish you all mm. the best going forward, especially uh, as you're heading into the National Arts Festival. It's going to be great seeing you there. Sure. Thank you so much. Thank you. Appreciate that. Thanks. That's uh, talented composer and guitarist Guy Buttery, who is the 2018 Standard Bank Young Artist winner for music. He has albums such as When I Grow Up and Fox Hill Lane, thanks to his unique style of guitar.